when people ask me about my own personal connection with Nutri Thatcher, I, I sometimes feel it's like the, the relationship in the Steven Spielberg film. It's a relationship between sort of Elliot and E.T. Uh, it's as if Mrs. Thatcher touched me on the forehead and said, I'll always be here. And it's been a bit, it, uh, been a bit strange. I also think that with, with Thatcher, I could have gone on to, um, I could have gone on to uh, mastermind as, as, as her, um, uh, as my specialist subject, because when I was writing this book, I got to know as much as you, you could about her. And in, in the 1980s, my live act was not a speech. Well, my live act was a question and answer session lasting about 30 minutes. And uh, after a while, you begin to, you know, prepare yourself for whatever, whatever question comes up. Um, and so I got to know her, I think, sort of quite well. And you see, with your d when you're doing a voice like that, and in general you are improvising, you're not necessarily scripting it. It's changing each time. What happens is, it has an immediacy. It has an aliveness, it has a realness. It's what actors talk about. You're suddenly in the moment. And so I thought my sort of, sort of theme, because it's a relatively short talk, but my theme would be to ask the, 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 the difference or the connection with what an impressionist does and what an actor does. You know, the, because the, they, they are the, they're distinct, but there are, there are similarities.